Hello everyone, in this particular video, we will quickly implement email verification in Flutter. I have also written a well detailed blog post explaining each and everything. So go through that blog post once, link is given in description. So this blog is divided into two part. Part one contain the logical implementation and part two contain UI of application. The first step is to connect your Flutter project to Firebase. I have already made a dedicated video for it. Or you can refer to this blog from link. Now I have already created files and folder according to this project structure. Also for animation I have added JSON file from Loti file website in asset folder. You can download it link is given in description to use this animation in your project add the path of json to your popspec.yml file also add this dependency in popspec.yml file i have already added it and at last in android manifest file add the internet permission now let's start building our application from UI part. We will quickly copy and paste the UI code and from the logical implementation we will copy the logical part. In this video we will copy paste entire code from blog quickly. If you want to understand it in depth then again go through this blog post. So now we copy paste the main.dart file code and from the part 1 we copy the initialization code and we paste it inside main function. Also for our authentication screen, we copy the UI part code and then from part one, we add uh, init state function. We are getting error as we haven't implemented login, sign up and home screen. Now we copy UI for sign up, home, email verification and login screen. Now our UI part is complete. So we move to part 1 and we add logical implementation of code in sign up screen, login screen and email verification screen. So at this point, our application is complete. Now let's see the flow of application like how it works. In this flow diagram, we can see if there is no user, then it go to login screen. And if user is unverified, then it go to email verification screen. And if user is verified, then it go to home screen from authentication screen so in our auth screen firebase auth dot instance dot auth state change give the current user and based on the value either current user is null current user email is verified we navigate user to corresponding screen now in our login screen when user press the login button we call sign in with email password function from firebase auth instance after it, we check email is verified or not from shared preference. If email is verified, then we navigate our user to home screen. Now in sign up screen, we create a is loading variable and we set it value to false. Based on this value, we show the button for sign up. Now let's see our sign up function. So the first thing is we check for the password and we set is loading value to true and we proceed with firebase auth instance and we call create user with email and password 
and after it we navigate user to email verification screen also we have this error snack bar to show any error message now in our email verification screen we take email address as parameter and we create verification check timer to continuously check whether email is verified or not we create a recent cooldown timer and we create remaining time we create can recent variable is loading variable and set it default value to false so in init state we call the send verification email start recent cooldown and start periodic uh, verification check function now we can see in start periodic verification check we check whether email address is verified or not every 5 second also in our start recent cooldown function we simply decrement the value of remaining time which is set at 60 second also in send verification email function we set is verifying to true after it we get the current user from firebase auth instance after it we send email to user by calling user dot send verification function which is provided by firebase after it finally we set is verifying value to false so far in this function the email is sent to the registered user now let's move to check email verification function same as previous it also get the current user from firebase and we check user dot email verified is true or not if email is verified then we cancel all the timer and store is email verified and user email value in the device local storage using shared preference after it we simply navigate user to our home screen now at last we dispose all timer in our dispose function now our application is complete so let's run application by registering new user also i uh, forgot to mention enable email and password signing in firebase authentication after it if we close our application and restart it then the state will be preserved and the application will show the uh, email verification screen and once you verify your email by clicking the link from your gmail account then within 5 second the user will be redirected to home screen so that's it we have implemented email verification successfully if you want to implement local and scheduled notification then watch this video and if you want to implement fingerprint authentication then watch this video